Care workers also feeling the effects of the post holiday surge. Since Christmas Eve, hospitals around the state have had a 30% increase in COVID-19 inpatients. CBS 46's Jamie Kennedy is live at the CDC tonight. And Jamie, some healthcare workers, well, they're telling you they are concerned about the agency's new quarantine guidelines. Why is that? Yeah, Tracy, exactly. Well, they're feeling like the CDC has really been pressured from outside sources to really come up with some of these new guidelines and also feel that the CDC is not talking to any of the people who are on the front line dealing with this stuff from day to day. So the new guidance allows for asymptomatic patients to only isolate for five days instead of 10. They should continue to wear a mask for another five days around others and a negative test is not required to end isolation. So comments on nurse associations social media pages echoed sentiments of the new CDC's guidelines putting people in harm's way. Nurses saying they are already fatigued from the past two years and feel these new guidelines only compound the situation. We are in just about the same place that we were when Delta started. We had uh, 10,044 cases. I wouldn't want as a patient for somebody who is COVID positive to be taking care of me. I wouldn't want somebody who's COVID positive taking care of my child. So coming up at six o'clock, we'll hear from an infectious disease specialist and from a National Nurses Association about what they think about these new guidelines. Live at CDC headquarters, Jamie Kennedy, CBS 46 News.